is Camda down here and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I'm going to be doing a nighttime face routine. Um, I've noticed that my face has been getting uh, pimply again so I'm like you know what I need to start working on my face again because you know I'm a cross guard and I'm always in the, going to be in the sun and the sun's what messed up my face really. And I need to start drinking more water too. Okay. Okay. So, I'm going to be basically showing y'all what I do when I do wash my face. Now, I added like the facial stuff as like extra in there. That's like your phone. Um, what you call it? Like now that my face is like really bad right now, I'm going to start doing it again. But usually on the regular, I just use that, um, what you call it, that brown box soap and the what you call it that blue jar container that's all i use on my face on a regular daily basis but you're gonna like i said you're gonna see me using those on facial masks for extra treatment and the hydro boost um sometimes i will switch out the soap the bar soap with the hydro boost or just you know vice versa type shit but i still like to use the blue jar because the blue jar has um it's like a peppermint feeling on there, and I use it as like a, a semi, a semi mask to kind of like keep it on there. It's really like soap you can wash off once you're done, but I like to make it stay on there. My face for a minute because they have pepper in it, like I said. Um, okay, okay, and honestly, um, what you call it? The peel off mask that y'all see me putting on right now, that black one. I don't really like putting that on like that because. It tends to get stuck in my um, edges. As you can see, my edges is kind of, you know, showing in the front. Every time I wash my face, it's gonna show. <laughs> I'll be trying to, sometimes I'll be trying to brush up my edges just for that, but it's just be coming back down. I try my hardest not to get my edges and it still got it and it was so hard. Like you're gonna see in like the, after this video or next clip, you're gonna see me trying to take it off my edges. And it hurts like hell. Like let me tell you something. Let me tell y'all something. That face mask hurts like hell to peel off and to take off your edges. Okay. I don't like putting that face mask on. I only did it for real for y'all. But on the real, I don't really do that shit too much. I'm more of an exfoliator type type of bitch. I have a what you call it. I have a mechanical or robotic um like pore cleaner. Like, like a vacuum, pore cleaner vacuum that I use for my nose area anyway. So that's why I stopped using the peel off mask because it is kind of harsh for my face because I have sensitive skin. I only do it if I really, really need it and I haven't done the vacuum in a while. Um, but yeah. And this um, peel off mask y'all see me have put on my face, like trying to adjust on my face. I really love it, and especially after I do that, um, probably that peel off mask or the pore vacuum. I tend to put that on right after to like kind of cool my face down because then my face get hot like because the blood rushes to the face when I'm putting off the face mask. Um, so I just use that mask to kind of cool me down some, close my pores up, and it has like some type of liquid thing in there that um, is good for your pores and it makes your face um, nice and shine, like glowy. It, the main purpose is to make it glowy and close your pores up, so that's what I do. This is all that I do on my facial routines, period, period, period. And if y'all like this video, please like, comment, subscribe, and tell me what y'all think down in the comment section below. You know, my dog, not others, be yourself. Okay, if you don't be yourself, then I don't know what to tell you, period. Bye, y'all.